Okay, so one of the features of SAP Business One that's not turned on when it's installed is the cockpit, and these are um, this is something that can can be very useful while working in SAP Business One. And to turn that on, first as a super user, you want to go into Administration, System Initialization, then General Settings, and then go to the co cockpit tab, and then select Enable and Update and then just say OK here. That's just letting you know that it won't take effect until the next time you log in. So once that's set and initialized, uh, then your end users, if they want to utilize it within their login, they can go into the Tools, Cockpit, and Enable Cockpit. And again, it's prompting them also uh, to log off and log on. So if we just go to Choose Company and just re-log in, and this will refresh our screen. and it brings up the cockpit. So what you have then is a couple of different areas of cockpits that are available, sales, services, and finance. And under each of those, you've got um, different established cockpits that are kind of preset and set up so that your end users can jump right in and get to work. So such as the sales, it's gonna show what the open documents are. And if we click on here and hit refresh, it's going to show us uh, the total numbers of sales orders, quotes, and so forth and so on that are in the system and active. So, and then for mine here, I've just got the home one selected. Um, I've gone in and changed the browser by going to settings and typing in, uh, changing the address that the default is SAP. And, um, and then I've got open documents down here and some message alerts. So, hope that's useful. Dig in there and play with it. If you've got any questions, let us know. Thanks.